Okay, we have espresso. Our favorite drink. Our favorite, Our favorite drink. Yep, we all love espresso, <laughs> don't we? <laughs> Do you want one before the song or after the song? During as well. During, okay. <laughs> Do you have time? Do you have a third hand? I'm not sure about that. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have to see. We'll have to see. Huh? <laughs> uh, no, it's uh, this has been a really fun song to play as well. So Mohini gave me uh, an espresso machine this year uh, for my birthday. And uh, so she named it actually espresso. Yeah, and um, it's good I, espresso. I had it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it makes really good espresso. Yeah, um, uh, musically, I think uh, it's a very funky song, and uh, the lines in it are very bluesy. Mm -hmm. And um, there's this middle part that Gino and I have. Mark kind of, I don't think Mark plays in there, doesn't he? I don't think he does. But it is a part of the, so so it goes. So the idea for this middle part that she's talking about is to go. And basically repeat that cycle. But so it's a three bar phrase. Yeah, which he makes says it, it like that. But the tricky part is the bass line is a little bit different yeah. with the kick pattern that's going on. So it's like I, I, I don't I don't know if Gino is listening to me when I'm playing that bass line. I am, but I'm not playing what you're playing. Exactly. But I am not <laughs> I just am not even listening to your kick. I'm listening to everything else, but I just like delete your kick in my because <laughs> it throws me off, you know. Um, because it's it's like too close, you know. But it's it's amazing how it works, though. Yeah, it, it works so cool. You you guys will hear it when you hear the album. And uh, yeah, let us know what you feel about the metal section. <laughs>